The web of life is a metaphorical web that displays the succession of organisms in an ecosystem linked together through the transfer of energy. It also highlights the fragility of our ecosystem. Much like a spider's web, the moment one strand breaks, the entire web begins to untangle. No matter what piece may go missing, whether it be grasshoppers or snakes, the web will inevitably fail to keep itself together. But its fragility isn't the only thing that makes the web of life special. It is the interrelationship within an ecosystem and the beauty that these natural connections possess. Lifetime environmentalist Catherine Plume, in a story she wrote for the WWF, had this to say about her experience in Don Sol and its remarkable web of life. I arrived dusk in Don Sol, an island town in the Philippines. The world was just taking on its magical evening spell as our boat pulled away from the pier and headed up the river. As we neared the riverbank, I detected a faint twinkling in the trees. The flashing grew more intense until it became a swirl of tiny rotating lights. Fireflies! But these were not like fireflies I'd ever seen. They flashed both on their own and also together. The sight was mesmerizing like strings of dancing white Christmas lights. Looking up into the trees, it was hard to tell stars from fireflies. <laughs> As we watched this firefly dance, our boatman softly said, Now, put your hand in the water. We were met with yet another treat. Light was emitted and the bioluminescence was created by our fingers as they moved through the water. It was an odd melancholy trip back down the river. I had the sense that I was leaving something very special behind that I may not ever encounter again. Don Sol's natural web of life is an interesting example of the fantastic interconnection of the members of an ecosystem. In Don Sol, fireflies congregate together in the mangroves where it is home to all sorts of food for them, with the mangroves in turn being a significant part of enriching the river with nutrients. These nutrient-rich waters then feed millions upon millions of microscopic plankton, the source of the bioluminescence within the river. And by Don Sol Bay, whale sharks are attracted to the various krill and plankton that feed on the nutrients that come from the river. This magical web of life has also integrated the people of Don Sol because of their ecotourism. However, Don Sol's magical web may not last for long. Fireflies are considered as key indicators of an ecosystem's health because they are extremely sensitive to environmental conditions. And they are especially sensitive to human activity, like pollution, toxic chemicals in the water, and habitat loss are all threats to firefly survival. And where the firefly goes, the rest will inevitably follow. So, what can we do? A lot. For example, awareness campaigns. Let people know that mangroves are protected in the Philippines. Inform people about the plight of the fireflies. Or, even simply, when going on echo tours, following the proper protocols of each tour can go a long way. As long as we still have our magical web, we still have a chance. We still have a choice.